The Queen doesn't have an intimate relationship with the Duchess of Cambridge, but the Duchess of Sussex makes her laugh, a royal expert has claimed. Ingrid Seward, editor-in-chief of Majesty magazine, has revealed that some members of the royal family have a much closer bond than others. The Queen admires Kate tremendously but does not have an intimate relationship with her as they don't have much in common, she told Fabulous Digital. I think the Queen and Kate have a more serious relationship as obviously Kate holds all the Queen's hope for the future and she would not want to do anything to upset that. The expert went on to question what Kate, 37, and Her Majesty, 93, would have in common apart from their royal duties, and claimed their relationship is much more formal. The common bond with Kate would be her children and I can't imagine the Queen spending too much time talking about them. She is a very shy woman. Meghan, also 37, showed her growing bond with the Queen when they carried out their first official engagements together in Cheshire on June 18th last year, just a month after her wedding. They seemed to get on famously, with Meghan giggling and whispering into the Queen's ear while watching a children's performance at the opening of a bridge across the River Mercy in Wins. With Meghan she would tread very carefully and do her best to make her feel at home, she told the publication. They have a love of dogs in common and Meghan knows how to make her laugh. The royal editor also highlighted that while the monarch has a close relationship to Prince William and Prince Harry, they don't see each other frequently. While she got to know William when he was at school at Eton and adores Harry's sense of humor, it's those that she spends most time with that she has closest ties to. Ingrid added that the Queen has a particularly good relationship with her eldest granddaughter Zara Tyndall, 38, her husband Mike, 40, and her brother Peter Phillips, 41. Last Tuesday, ITV's racing coverage showed Mike making the Queen laugh when he removed his top hat to reveal a miniature replica tucked inside at Royal Ascot. He later revealed it was made of chocolate and was a gift he was taking home for his five-year-old daughter, Mia. The former rugby player performed his entertaining routine to the amusement of Sophie Wessex and Princess Beatrice, but when asked whether the Queen found the magic trick funny, he replied, they are your words, not mine.